Welcome back, Team Forever. Back again with another video. I'm back with another K-pop video. As you can see by the title of this video, I am counting down my top 10 favorite K-pop groups 2019. 2019 was the year I got into K-pop, and it just so happened I reacted to 10 groups. So why not take those 10 groups and rank them from 10 to 1? Which ones that I like the best? Which one that I like the least? From 1 to 10. I actually reacted to another group, Icon. It was one of the first groups I reacted to, but I only reacted to one song last year. So I'm not going to include them inside this list because I reacted to one song and I didn't even react to the whole song. I did a second reaction to them in 2020, so check those videos out. And I also did not include NCT Dream, which I reacted to technically in 2020, so they were not included. So the groups that I will be counting are, well, the ones I reacted to. I'm not gonna name them all. First of all, let me just say I like all these groups. It's just me ranking which one I like the best to which one I like the least best, because I like them all. Let me just say that in the beginning of this video. Number 10, I actually gave it to a group that a lot of my viewers love, because their videos get like the most amount of views. It's actually Red Velvet. Hear me out, y'all. The main reason why Red Velvet's my 10th favorite is because, to me, Red Velvet songs are very, very girly. And when I listen to them, I really never listen to their songs again after I listen to it. Because their songs, they're just so girly, and they're just not my style. When I listen to it the first time and I'm reacting to it, I can recognize if it's a good song. But I would probably never want to, like, listen to it again. Does that make sense? I like the group. I like the songs. But they're not my favorite. Hope y'all don't get offended. I really like the group. Number nine, it is Super M, actually, because I only listen to one song of theirs, and I, I'm really interested in the group. I'm really interested in the group. That's why I put them as number nine and not number 10, because I want to hear more from them, because the group is like a group of all-stars, but I've only heard one song, and then although it's a banger, I couldn't put them above some of these other groups. So Super M is my ninth favorite. Number eight is actually GOT7. GOT7, I like the group a lot, but it, it just comes to a point where it's like, some songs from GOT7, I don't even remember reacting to. Uh, sorry, it's, some of their songs are forgettable to me. I love their, I love their song Just Right though. That's, that's a banger, I love it. Number eight, seven. Oh, that's funny. Got seven. If you would have just made one more, you would have been number seven. Number seven for Got Seven. But no. Number seven actually goes to Monster X. I love Monster X. It's one of my favorite groups. But it's number seven because there's six groups that I like more than it. Monster X is one of my more recent groups, too. So I haven't heard a lot of their songs. And maybe that's why they're, they're number seven, which is a good number to be at. But. I'm really interested in hearing more from Monster X and learning more about their group. But for right now, they're my seventh favorite group. Number six. Oh my god, I remember when I first reacted to this group. It probably had like the best first reaction. I love this group so much. Number six goes to Stray Kids. Stray Kids. Oh, I love them. I love them. Stray Kids. I'm looking forward to reacting to more. I love their videos. I think their group is super fun. I think it'll be fun to go to their concerts or hang out with them. But there's a couple groups that I like more than them. But I love them. I love Stray Kids. They're amazing. Top five. Here we go. Number five is NCT U. NCT U. Uh, I love their songs. It's, 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 it gets to a point where it's like, all right, I don't have anything bad to say about them. It's just... They're number five because I like four groups more than them. <laughs> so I just, I really like my uh, NCTU. Love their, the few songs. They don't have a lot of songs, too. That's another thing. Is they don't have that many songs. I, I find myself looking for more, but I think I like all their songs. Number four, it actually goes to BTS. BTS, America's favorite K-pop group. I love the fact that they have so much variety, and I love their live performances. Their live performances are ace. Love them. Love BTS. Number three, I'm so happy that this group made it so low. They were one of the first groups I reacted to and I had so much fun reacting to their songs. Blackpink and yeah, yeah, I love Blackpink. And like they're the first group that I actually proper learned about because there's only four people in the group and I, I know I can 
I can distinctly remember the four people and things about them and verses that they did, you know? The, well, they were the first group where I could do that, so. And I feel like even though they're an all-girl group, their songs aren't as girly as Red Velvet. I hate to compare, but that's just my opinion. So I just, I wish I had more stuff to react to from Blackpink. And I, I really like the group. I want them to keep doing as good. As well as they've been doing, they did Coachella last year and I just love Blackpink. Number two. This hurts, cause I really, they were my number one favorite group for so long. And I love their music, and they have such a variety in their live performances, their dance practice, their music, their videos, everything. EXO. EXO was the group that got me into K-pop. I love the group, love EXO. But it was a group that I like more, and y'all already know who it is. Number one favorite K-pop group of 2019 is NCT 127. <laughs> I love all of their songs. I love everything about the group. If I could go to any concert from K-pop, it would be NCT 127. If I had to let somebody who doesn't like K-pop get into K-pop, I would want them to listen to NCT 127. Their dance move, if I could dance like any K-pop group, it would be NCT 127. They just, they have the best music, the best videos, the best dance practices. I know like a lot of my viewers favorite group is Red Velvet, a lot like GOT7, and a lot like BTS, EXO, and Blackpink. So I think it's kind of unique that my favorite is NCT 127. They have one of my favorite, some of my favorite K-pop songs of NCT 127 is my favorite group of 2019. I want to thank all of y'all who helped me get through all of 2019 and got me into K-pop. All these groups that I reacted to were put in via request from y'all. Except for EXO, because that was one of the first groups I ever reacted to. Thank you, EXO, for getting me into K-pop. Love that group. But that's it for this video, y'all. Leave y'all top 10 or favorite groups inside the comment section down below. Tell me why they're your favorite, too. And until next time, y'all, 